talking about looking at what kind of hair they got on. Right. right. You know, what, what kind of, that's not what I mean. What kind of clothes they got on. But what kind of shoes they wear. You know, what kind of car they drive. I'm not talking about reading people like that. I'm talking about reading. Listen to me very carefully. I'm talking about reading the spiritual condition of their lives. All right, discern. He said, "Good, great master, what, good master, what should I do? You know, to inherit eternal life. You, you know, you know the commandments. You know, blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, I've done all these." But Jesus looked at him and loved him. And one thing thou, what was it? Was discernment? One thing you lack. So when I was, I was uh, going to Singapore years ago, I was sitting there by my company. My boss wasn't saved. Mm -hmm. And, uh, for <laughs> and, uh, and he, he, he tried to, he hired his son to be around me. Because <laughs> his son was really wild. So he actually had him work with me. And he said, son, you're going to be around this blankety blank preacher. <laughs> He said, this is one of the best blank and blank preachers you'll ever <laughs> You do what he blank and blank says. <laughs> I mean, he wasn't saying blank. <laughs> I mean, because you know, I mean, look at my... <laughs> wow. And he put his son around me because he wanted his son to be around me. Wow. He hired his son. So, anyway, his name was Tom. He, he sent me to... Uh, 